Good afternoon. As Mayor Keller pushes for voters to pass a $14 million bond to build a new homeless shelter in the city, he announced today the city will be adding more resources to the current one on the west side. News 13's Brady Wakayama is live there with more. Kim, the mayor, along with other city partners and nonprofits, gave us a tour right inside this facility earlier today, showing us how they plan on using the space moving forward and how they plan on providing essential services to the hundreds of people that stay here every night. We'd like to actually have multiple small sites, but we've got to start somewhere. So this is literally about a first step for our city. Mayor Keller hopes to make this facility a one-stop shop. Service providers announced they will be providing medical services, case management, and job placement services, something they haven't provided consistently since opening up three years ago. Mayor Keller is hopeful voters approve a $14 million bond to help pay for a new homeless center. But until then, he says they're going to utilize what they have. You know, I mean, I think everyone would love to eventually not have to use an old jail for anything. Uh, but at the end of the day, right now, it has ample space and ample parking and it's safe and secure. And so if there's a need for anything in the city that requires that, we're going to use the assets we got. The city says they serve about 300 people every single night at this facility. And Mayor Keller says it costs about $4.5 million to operate this facility every year. Kim, back to you. Okay, thanks, Brady. Now, the city says about $1 million of that $4 million total is only in transporting people to and from the facility.